Okay, let's do a stylized Christmas tree real quick. You can use a shape from the library. Uh, just get the diamond and apply. That'll put it in the center of the canvas. If you right click on the shape, you can edit points and click on the center point and drag it up. Then replicate that in the inspector in the replicator tab. We want one column and we'll adjust the rows in a minute. I want to switch this to 3D and for the angle end I'm just going to run this up to 1440 and just type it in. For the origin let's set this to either top or bottom. If you go with the top run the scale down just a little bit and run the scale end up. And if you go with the bottom you would do the opposite. Now let's get a little color on these. Click on the original diamond. Go into the shape style and let's add this to a medium dark green. And we'll add an outline to a darker green. Uh, I like to adjust the opacity down a little bit. And Let's turn this into a 3D project. Let's add a couple more rows. If you click on the original shape again and right click in the bounding box, you can edit points. When you get close to the line, you get a pen. If you double click on the line, it should add a point like that. And then you can edit your shape in real time. So I'm going to pull these out a little bit like this. Hold down the command key, click and drag on the points and smooth them out. Back in the replicator tab you can adjust the height of your tree like this. and play with the scale a little more and make some variations like that. Okay, if we add a light and shadows. Let's pull the light out and see space somewhat. Let's bring it down. back in the replicator you can do some various things like play with the angle randomness and you can wind this up a little more to create different shapes and patterns for different types of trees and it makes a pretty nice little stylized Christmas tree. 
hope I got this out in time. This is actually one part of a larger tutorial that was to develop the whole scene and I may or may not get those out in time but they will be cut up and put out in pieces since the entire thing ran about 30 minutes. But I just wanted to get this out as quick as possible and I hope this helps and I'll catch you on the next one.